everyone, welcome back to Math Wizard Juror. Today's video is about rotation. In transformational geometry, we have rotation. So rotation is just rotating the object in a specific angle of rotation. So for example, we have triangle ABC and we are going to rotate this clockwise or anti-clockwise. And you need to note the two things. One, we need to note where is our point of rotation. And two, we're going to note what is the angle of rotation. Example, our point of rotation is point B. The triangle ABCD is rotated 90 degrees clockwise. The image would look like this. And we have point A, point B, and point C. On the other hand, if triangle ABCD will be rotated 90 degrees anti-clockwise, it means it's going to the left. The image will be like this. And this is our point A, point B, and point C. Lastly, when this image, triangle ABCD, will be rotated 180 degrees counterclockwise or 180 degrees clockwise, the image would look like this. And we have point A, point B, and point C. Have you noticed? that this figure is now rotated in three specific angle of rotation and they share the common point. Our point B is invariant. How to rotate triangle ABC 90 degrees clockwise when our point of rotation is zero, zero. So let's try to rotate our triangle ABC and we have to follow our rule. Rule is in every coordinate X, Y, it will become y negative x. It means that we are going to interchange our x and y and make our x opposite or times negative one. Identify our coordinates for a, b, and c. So we have our a is one, three, b is one, one, our c is five, one. And we are going to interchange our x and y so y will be now our x position then our x's will become opposite or multiplied by negative one and our new coordinates a will become three negative one b will become one negative one c will become one negative five and after that we are going to plot our points and it would look like a sub one three negative one b sub 1, 1 negative 1, and c sub 1, 1 negative 5. So now our object is, was rotated 90 degrees clockwise. So the triangle now ABCD will be rotated anti-clockwise 90 degrees. So the thing to note is our rule. The rule is so simple, just in every x and y coordinates of our points, we're going to change it into negative y comma x it means we are going to interchange a position of our x and y so y now will be multiplied with negative one followed by x N then note the coordinates of our vertices so you have a one three b one one c five one and we are going to interchange the position of your coordinate so your new coordinates are a negative three one b negative one one and c negative 1, 5. And then we're going to plot our points A, negative 3, 1, B, negative 1, 1, C, negative 1, 5. And the triangle is now in this position. Lastly, when triangle ABC will be rotated 180 degrees counterclockwise or 180 degrees clockwise, our rule is in every coordinates of x and y will be changed into its opposites. So we are going to multiply each coordinate by negative one. So our x will become negative x and our y will become negative y. So our points for a the same, one three, b one one, then c five one. We are going to multiply each coordinate by negative one. So we have a negative one, negative three, b negative one, negative one, and c negative 5 negative 1 after which we can plot the points on the coordinate we have negative 1 negative 3 we have b negative 1 negative 1 then c 
negative 5, negative 1. Then we can plot our triangle A, B, C. I hope you learned something from today's video. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.